And what is going on, my YouTubers? Okay, now uh, here's a, uh, you know, just be a real, uh, I'm trying to be enthusiastic about this. Um, so I want to show y'all how, what format emotion gets put into. Um, the courts have all agreed on one, uh, you know, in the United States, have agreed on one form of, uh, not form, but one uh, agreed on one program to make motions official. Um, you know, that's compatible with everything. You know, all systems and so on and so forth. And that's PDF. PDF is, um, you know, you can sign things. You can, you, uh, 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 you can, oh, you, there's, there's, there's so much you can do on a PDF where it, it, it's, it's, it's very, flex, it's a very flexible program. Um, me personally, I don't use Adobe. Um, I am forced to, uh, use certain, uh, other ways and means to, to, uh, to, uh, you know, create my PDFs and so on and so forth. So, um, I'm going to show you what I use and I am going to show you, uh, what to do and how to do it. Okay, hold on. just want garbage out of there. Um, just, you know, just have to take out the trash real quick. All right. Um, now, uh, all right, let's start off with first and foremost, I would like to say, uh, uh, how about this? You make the decision on what program you want to use. So you will go to alternative two, alternative two.net, uh, this way you'll find a, you know, uh, this is, this is, if you cannot afford Adobe, um, this is something that you can, uh, this is a program, I mean, I mean, this is a website that you can find, uh, basically alternative programs from pay, you know, with, uh, you know, for free. So, uh, PDF, PD, PDF, uh, editor. Okay. PDF editor. Now, they'll give you a list of programs where you can, uh, you know, and whatever you feel fit, you know, so on and so forth. They have paid ones. They have free ones. I suggest they don't have the, uh, dang, they don't have the search filter because sometimes they, they put a uh, search filter. Um, you know, but, uh, but yeah, you know, like you try to find the, hold on, sorry. Freemium, propriety, paid, freemium. And then there's some that are open source. Freemium is basically, uh, you know, you have to, uh, you know, you, you know, you at least, at least have to pay once. Um, but this one says free, flat out free. I believe that one's flat out free, but that's for iPhone. Uh, they give you uh, multiple, um, you know, different kind of programs on which one they're compatible with. Some just for Android, some just for you know phones, some for computers, some for Mac, some for Windows, so on and so forth. So uh, you want to try to find. The open source ones. I haven't came across it. Hold on, wait a minute. Let me put in, watch. Adobe. Acrobat. Adobe Acrobat. Okay. Here you go. Now, this is where you'll get the, give you, you got to type in the what program you want to alternative to. That's how you get to the uh, uh, filter, um, free, open source, you know, open source, here you go. 
Now here's all these programs that are open source. Open source means that they're 100% free. There's no charge, never. You know, so I have one that I'm currently using, which I'm just getting the hang of it. I like it so far. The only thing I don't like is you cannot, uh, they don't help you embed uh, PDFs with videos. So, or rich media, that's, you know, where I'm at right now with it. But, but this is the best, you know, route if you're going to uh, just worry about filing paperwork. Uh, and so let's go here. PDF 24. I, that's where I found this. I found, I found this on Alternative 2. Um, so, uh, go here. Now, I already have a PDF saved, so you know what? Let me show you on how to save a PDF. Personally, um, th this tool, PDF24, is very, very uh, flexible. Uh, very, it's, it's a good tool to have. If you have hard drive space, just to have it on tuck is a great thing to have. Uh, that's, that's, that's also the thing about... Um, certain uh certain uh, uh uh free program freemium programs open source they they aren't 100 percent like the program that they're trying to mimic so uh but if you have the extra hard drive space if you have an external hard drive that you formatted where you can uh you know upload programs on it great um let me, let me go to testing my testing file uh new Here you go, or you know what? Hold on, wait a minute. Uh, let me see if I can do it this way, first and foremost. Uh, no, this is this is this is the way I've been going about it. Okay, see, I made a a, a rich text document, text document. You go to PDF twenty four. You then convert to PDF to file. There you go. Convert file to PDF. Testing, back in testing. Uh, new example. Because I'm showing you the format that these go in. So, okay, examples there. Okay, now, um, let me go back home. Now, uh, edit PDF. I'm only going to show how to do the federal civil uh, format. So, um, if you looked at my other videos, you'll see um, how to uh, how to um, get the court that you are in. Um, so or. Or the district that you'll be filing with. Usually, it's the one closest to you within your state. I think that ma I think within your state matters. Not one hundred percent sure, but okay. Here we go. Okay, uh, you're gonna now. You, now you went to edit PDF. You clicked on the. Oh, is this it? Hold on, wait a minute. Hold on. Wait, eh, shoot. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Hold on. Let me start over. Okay. Uh, edit PDF, choose file, example, there we go, okay. Now, um, what you're going to do is click on the add text. Once clicked on the add text, you are going to, uh, 
once you get your text box here. Um, you're going to want to make the text a little smaller. I would suggest a 16 size. So let's type in 16. Uh, okay. Now, let's make it. you're going to make it center. This is going to be at the top right here. This is going to be your head, uh, a header. So, uh, states district court. Okay, hold on. It is not done. I just want to center. Okay. Now, all right. Depending on what state you're in, you're going to put. Now, depending on what state you're in, um, hold on, I am currently doing something right now. Sorry about that, people. Oh, sorry, people. Um, I definitely did forget my T's. Sorry about that. District of, you're going to type in what state you're in. Jersey. Whether it's Montana, uh, so on and so forth, it all depends on, you know, like I said, it all depends on what state you're in. Uh, California, so on and so forth. So, Better yet, <laughs> your state <laughs> here. There you go. <laughs> All right. So let me uh. Do Jersey. All right. Then you're gonna put civil divi division. I think that's division. Hold on. My uh, Grammarly uh, doesn't work with this program. I want to see what I can do about that. So, uh, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Yes, I have a spelling issue. You know, I, uh, very bad spelling issue. So, here you go. Uh, make that bold. Okay. You got that at, as your header now. Um, Open another text. Um, hold on. Weep. Okay. Um, here we go. Now we're not going to make this one centered. We're going to make this one coming off the sides here. All right. Now uh, start here with this. No. Hold on. Versus, or your name. Now, uh, you know, it'd be a smart thing to, uh, you know, put a, you know, a double space. Um, just cause. Uh, so... Who your suing suing, but um, I'm gonna put the actual name. Like for example, mine is County 
of, or one of mine. Now, this is a little, uh, this is a, uh, little jewel, little jewel. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. I want to get that down to 16. See? Just because the text box is open, you ain't got to highlight everything. You can adjust the size. Bold. All right. County of Monmouth. Uh, heck. Hold on. Okay, there we go. You, you got to click back down. Okay, now, uh, I usually see these in lower case. No, 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 no. You can do it in upper, uppercase, too. I think it depends. Uh, but it don't matter. All that it is is initial. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do lowercase just for, uh, you know, argument's sake. ET dot AL dot. ET dot AL, it's, it's uh, I believe it's a, uh, a, uh, a Latin, uh, you know, pronunciation. Uh, it means entail all defendants because you have... Because you're not going to type in, uh, uh, put a comma and, uh, 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 Brian McMenemy. You're not going to, you know, type in and then comma county, uh, you know, comma, uh, Michael Gall, you know, because that is, you know, so on and so forth. You know, you're not going to type in so on. They're like, because if, if you have like 16, 17 people, 16, 17 defendants, you know, it's, it, it, it's, it's going to be too much. You know, you, 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 you know, it's going to end up like going into your motion. So, uh, you're going to put ET dot AL dot. That's what you're going to put. Uh, you know, entail all defendants. Just the first person you put. And then, so on and so forth. So, now you're going to put another text box. Uh, hold on. Boom. Another text box. And you already have it on that. So, I'm going to try and line it up. I'm put 16 again. Okay. Make it bold. Okay, so here you're gonna put. I really wish I had lines. I really do. Like I said, I'm just figuring this out. So I'll learn. I'll learn. Uh, okay. Now you're gonna put. the docket number uh, type in civil plaint hashtag now where you're going to go to uh, where you're going to go I don't know if it's civil docket number complaint I don't know uh, but let's go here I'll get, I'll find that out right now. You're going to type in, uh, I'm going to show you what to type in it said, like, you know, so going to go, you know, so you can Google it versus county of Monmouth. A great place to go for updates of your case is, would be, put space, Pacer Mon, Pacer Monitor. That is the, see, boom, here it is. Oh, wow. Well. Okay. Boom. Okay, yes, case number. It's a case number. So, navigate here and look, see, there's the ETAL. Let me tell you all. Uh, you're going to, here's your case number. What I usually use, I highlight it and then put, press Control C. Don't forget Control C. That's copy. Uh, once you get the hang of it, you know. Civil complaint. Now you're gonna 
control V. That means paste. So now you got your complaint number there. Try to line it up a little bit, push it over a little bit, you know. Oop. Okay. Now, um, when you do motions, um, do, you can say, you could request anything you want. Just as long as it's like, you know, just don't, don't, don't be a jerk off about it. You know, or don't like, you know, don't, don't, you know, do, you know, you know, but you can, you'd be surprised the things that you can make into motions. Motion to recall warrant. That's criminal, but we're talking about civil here. But I'm saying uh, a motion to request discovery. Uh, you know, um, discovery would be, uh, you know, uh, or, or motion to receive evidence, which would be, uh, for example, let's start with, hold on. Hold on, let's uh, go back to this, this, let's go back to 16. Enter. Okay, now we're here. Uh, but this time we're going to put put it on the middle. Um, okay. Uh, motion to quest. Motion to request evidence, but it would be uh, 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 now when you're requesting motion motion to request evidence from a uh, you know from a attorney that um, from an attorney that. That's defending law enforcement officials. It's called uh, evidence that that only defendant can access. So this is why you do the motion to request evidence. You know, like yes, I have other videos on you know receiving documentations and all this, you know, uh, I'm putting, putting one on Oprah. I got Freedom of Information Act. There's things, but there's times you could use that. There's certain places for certain things and for certain times for certain things. Um, so, hold on. So, um, So, uh, motion to request evidence. Um, that's it on that one. Okay. We'll move that up a little bit. Line it up a little bit more. Good. There you go. All right. So, now we are on another text box. This is going to be... The we're, gonna, we're taking it off center. We're doing uh, from the line. So now, so uh, that's twenty-eight. Go back to. All right, we're gonna make this a little. Nah, I'll keep it uniform. Okay. Now, when you are doing a motion and you are a pro se litigant. Uh, always talk about yourself in the third person. You are the plaintiff, not the defendant. I got get that confused so often for being plaintiff, you know, um, for being defendant for so long. <laughs> so there's times I catch myself writing defendant. I'm like, yeah, oh, no, I'm not defendant. I'm the plaintiff because you're prosecuting this claim, so you're the plaintiff. Uh, so let's start with. Um, Plaintiff is
plaintiff is requesting defendant to def uh, requesting defendant to basically uh, to give plaintiff the following evidence of claim due to the issue of defendant being the only has access to the following material now people think that uh you know oh they're not just gonna hand it over they have to hand it over they have record of it especially if you went to internal affairs already you know well generally speaking uh for the most part in the state of new jersey but ever since ever since George Floyd. George Floyd was the push that we needed for there to be more stringent and strict uh, use of force laws for use of force laws also uh, you know uh, better better uh, record keeping uh better um you know because because there's so many so much evidence from other places from that from that case amazing amazing um you know like george floyd was like i feel like he he was he is the equivalent to to you know like he like a real martyr to for us you know these days you know with everything that it that it has uh, caused, it's just heartbreaking, but he was sacrificed. He really was, and it's just, I'm, I'm not going to get into any more of that, but, you know, just basically, it perpetuated our access, the exposure um, you know, there's, there's, uh, you could easily look up the use of force laws within your state where, um, where you will be able to see their, their, that local attorney general, uh, you know, the, that local attorney general's decision on the extent of use of force. Uh, a lot, uh, you know, a lot of places really have the same you know, for the most part, especially after George Floyd, but, uh, but for the most part, it's, though, all that record keeping, there's a reason for it, and they abide by it, so, uh, you know, that, for the most part, you, uh, along the lines of records, I would, I would suggest to, uh, also read up, especially if you're a reader, uh, read up on your state's uh, record. It's it, it would be considered administrative law, you know. Um, and hold on, wait a minute. Basically, it uh, it's from it. It would be considered. Um, uh, record retention and disposition laws or schedule laws 
uh, you know, they, you know, there's, they keep certain records a certain period of time, especially if it can't, comes from a government entity. You know, if there was something that happened, it's called a, uh, a, uh, a, uh, incident. Like once they have an incident report and that cop must put, must bring the videos along with that incident. Because if he don't bring the videos along with that incident, he's in trouble. What are you hiding? There's a reason why they have retention of these records. Um, for example, the, uh, the, um, the records retention, it, it, it's, it's, you know, it, you know, some states, you know, for example, New Jersey is up to five years. You know, this is, you know, they use all, you know, retention of everything. All, all things that are recorded of any incident automatically gets preserved, especially if you complain about it right away. You know, uh, some municipalities have their own uh, uh, record retention uh, scheduling, but that breaks the state's law. You understand? Um, so you know, there's, there's, there are conflicts. But if you make complaint soon enough, the sooner the better. You should not slack on this. But back to this. Um, the plaintiff is requesting to give requesting defendant to give plaintiff the following evidence of claim due to the issue of plaintiff being the only uh, defendant being the only one that has access to the following material this is where you uh oh hold on wait i want to want to indent that oh no no you won't let me indent come on teach you this in school indent nope wow all right hold on One, wait a minute, gotta do some stuff here, okay, okay, now, um, you know, defendant being the only one to be able to follow the access of, um, a material, space, space, or enter, 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 uh, I would say, uh, you know, uh, this is where you want to underline and make bold, you don't want to make your, uh, Dang, this one won't. Mm. Okay, all right. This is where. Hold on. Ah! That just didn't happen. That just did not happen. Did that just happen? That just happened. That just happened. Wow. Okay. Um. Oh, holy shit! That really just happened. That really just happened. Oh my god. Now I gotta start over. Motherfucker. <sighs> That's some bullshit. That's some real bullshit. That's crazy that that just happened. Okay, well, moving on. Um, oh my god, that just pissed me off so bad. So bad, that just pissed me off. Hold on, wait a minute. I am going to uh, pause this video. Because I am not having this. Okay, now, um, <laughs> here we go. I, uh, I redid it a little bit. Um, I reworded a little bit. Uh, so on and so forth. I'm going to save it right now. Um, okay, uh, yes, save, yes. Um, I said plaintiff is requesting that defendant gives plaintiff the following material evidence as listed due to plaintiff's inability to gain evidence and defendants being the only ones that can obtain the following evidence. So, new text box. Uh, here you go. Now, uh, new text box, we're going to make them 16. 16 again. Make America 16 again. 
All right. Uh, joking, of course. Joking. 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 Uh, okay. Now, um, you know, you also want to underline this because, you know, this is the, uh, you know, this is just what, oh, you'll see. You'll see what I mean. You'll, you'll see the reason. All right. Uh, oh, come on. All right. Double click, motherfucker. List of list of evidence. Yeah. All right. List of evidence. Oh, Vito! Vito! Oh, my man! One of the fucking... One of the ones that's following me. Look at that. Yeah. All right. Now, another uh, text text box. Um, uh, momento. Uh, 16. Um, hold on now. So... Here we go. Uh, okay, list of evidence. Uh, any and all videos, video, sir. God, I fucking hate this. Yes, I'm spell correcting on my phone. Sorry. Okay. Oh, and two L's. Two L's. Video surveillance of evidence of and any video evidence of Any and all surveillance of video surveillance of incident and any video evidence after incident, i.e. transport videos, constant watch videos, any and all videos that would have 
plaintive on it. Okay. Uh, new box. Any and all digital and physical document pertaining, sorry, to Pertaining to, uh, see, I get I get stuck on fucking plaintiff. So used to being a defendant, I, I, I get every, every time I I got I got I get stuck. So uh, pertaining to plaintiff and incident. The only reason why I say uh, pertaining to plaintiff and incident. Is because uh, you can easily gain uh, a whole lot more documentation you didn't think you could uh, have, uh, or just just you know extra documentation of in general. Um, incident. Uh, yeah, should be good. Uh, One, that's two. One momento. All right. So, uh, okay, now, uh, All past I you I swear to God, can't wait till I get Grammarly working on, on my uh, thing. Um, and, uh, I mean, I mean, really, and so on, um, you know, listen, don't think that there's certain criteria as to what a, a, a motion can be, because really, there really isn't any criteria, it's just a request, it's just a documented request that you're asking the court to do, to order, um, you know, so don't think that, like, you know, there's only certain, you know, you can only file for certain things. You can file for anything. Sometimes, don't be afraid to ask. Those federal court judges are very, very, um, very, very, very human. You know, I was talking to somebody last night where, uh, you know, I, I was I was telling her about uh, federal court judges. You know, somebody I was uh, seeking uh, some assistance with some stuff. Uh... And so, you know, she was surprised that, 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 you know, when I said, oh, no, they're, they're, no, those, those federal court judges, when it comes down to pro se litigants and helping yourself, they are so lenient with things where it's just, it's just amazing. 
They're human beings. They aren't like these corrupt municipal court judges. You know, I like to call them penny chasers or, uh, you know, pimp in the black fucking dress. Uh, you know, like penny chaser municipal court judges or corrupt superior court judges that, you know, that won't fucking play ball on a motion to dismiss over over technicalities and so on and so forth where you end up doing your time or half of your time just waiting for a pellet to overturn your conviction. Retarded. I swear to God. So, um... So, uh, uh, uh... Here we go. So basically what I'm trying to say is, uh, you know, these are mainly the the main ones that you need, uh, you know, or, or request. Uh, you know, and... And just keep on going down the list. Whatever your mind can think of, go for it. You know, uh, another thing uh, is uh, is phone calls, text messages. Uh, you know, you can either do through an Oprah Act or you can ask the court to request. They, um, you know, uh, they, they, they... You know, because if they're using an official phone, they are uh, recorded. Uh, all lines in jails are recorded, even the phone lines. Which hmm, I think I'm gonna, uh, I think I'm gonna try to request that now. Oof, don't know why I didn't think about that sooner. Uh, yeah. So remember, governmental phones are recorded. If there is an incident, it is preserved. You understand? Yeah, up to five years, sometimes ten. Uh, you know, so just keep that in mind. Um, now I'm going to uh, basically uh, want to say, uh, oh, I'm not going to end it because this ain't, this ain't the end. This is not the end. Uh, here you go. Hold on. Wait a minute. Uh, let's put in another box, another text box. Uh Let's make it 16 again. Put it over here. All right, you're going to line it up. And line it up, line it up. Put it on the line, put it on the line. Because it's on the line. There you go. Now. Oh. Oh boy. Pro se. Remember, you're a pro se litigant. Uh, and remember, don't forget this, because I forget it a lot. We're only human, but um, oh, let's bring it back down to 16. 26, 16. Okay. This is one I always forget. Date. <laughs> yeah, like a jerk off. Like a like a jerk off. Alright, uh what is this? Um two Wow. See? That that goes and shows you where my mind is at. I'm still in two thousand nineteen. 2019 was such a scarring year to me that it. I, I, 2019 is scarred me for life. I'm stuck in 2019 for the rest of my life. For real, I swear to God. Swear to God. So, 22. Or best to put the whole date. Um, okay. That's one. I would like to... Uh, Oh, that's a whole nother video. Uh, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. 
wait a minute. Okay, I'm gonna show you how to add pages to your PDF. So, add page numbers, boom. Was it, uh, which one was it? Example. All right. So once that's loaded up, I wanna say angle, font size, 10, there we are. I'll just put, I'll put two for the most part. Um, I forgot about this. Two out of two, I would think, maybe. I don't know. I don't know what this means. No clue. A little lost. Oh well, let's give it a shot. You see? I like how how it uh how it lets you see it before uh saving it. That's cool. All right. Oh, come on. No, that's to add page numbers. Nah, we ain't doing that. We ain't doing that. No, nah, I ain't saving that. No. Nah, all right. I was wrong. That's the actual to to add page numbers to it. Okay. All right. Well, um Let's just do another one then. Okay, now that now that your file is saved, um, let's go to another one. This will be your uh, when you file a motion, you need to put in a. Uh, it's a, it's called a uh, uh, in support of motion. Uh, uh, clarification or certification of certification of support of motion that's what it's called so uh, hopefully I got hopefully this one is uh, clear I think so uh, you know all right good cool 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 all right let me get this one going um, hold on okay all right uh, Certification in support. Support. Hold on a minute. 16. Oh, yeah, bold. Okay. In support. Come on. In support of motion. And you are going to say, you're going to say, uh, let's put another, uh, what you call it here? Put that there. Need this. Oh my God, I did it again. How do I keep on doing that? The fuck? Oh my God. Why does that shit keep on fucking, that's fucking annoying. That's fucking annoying. That is really, really, really annoying. Oh my god! Holy shit! I gotta, I gotta figure out. I gotta, I gotta do something. I gotta do something for that. That's some, that's some real live, uh, piss me off shit right there. Like I'm gonna end up breaking my computer. <laughs> I'm gonna end up breaking my computer because of it. Like that's how bad it is. Hold on. All right. You know, I forget to put in the certifications of support of motion, and uh, the judge is very nice. Again, these federal civil court judges are human beings. They're human beings, dude. So, like, for real, for real, like, like it, it, it's it's uh. You know, I forgot to put in the certification of support of motion, and they was, he didn't, he didn't even bat an eyelash at it. Like, that's how human being they are. 
It's like they literally give pro se litigants so much slack. It's great. All right, uh, let's go back down to 16. I don't want to make it bold. Really? Really? Hold on. What's going on, Pop? Hello? What's going on? Hello? I'm doing a video right now. Hold on. I'm, I'm up at CVS, okay? I will. I'm forward. Can you make it to the, to the job? No, I am Pop. Pop, I barely have gas. But okay, yes, okay. I can. Okay, I, I'll get there. No, no, I can make it. I can make it to, to to there. But I need, but I need some bread though. For you know, you know, as soon as, as soon as I'm done, because I'm gonna be out. I gotta run right up to the uh, gas station. Whew, All right, now uh, that's uh, handled. Uh, forgot to pa pause the video on that. All right, so uh, this is the last thing. Uh, hold on, six, sixteen. Okay, uh, I. This is what you're gonna put. This is what you're gonna put. Uh, I let's say your your name here. You're gonna put your name, not my name. <laughs> so want to be clear about that. Uh, I. M in support of this motion. I don't know why. I don't know why. They I don't I really don't know why. And That's all you need to put, for real. That's really all you need to put. Uh, hold on, along the lines of the what you need to put there. Boom, another text. You're going to do... Uh, Sixteen. Um, you're gonna put your lines again. Put... Your name, put your name again. Oh, I like to put capital L. Okay, and remember, like I always forget. Like I always forget. Date. That motherfucking date. Do it all the time. I swear to God, I did it like ten times. Alright, uh I think it was two twenty-four slash Alright, cool. Alright. And then you're going to save this as your Support of motion. Save. Now signing. Uh, signing. Uh, this is what a lot of uh, attorneys do. Um, I don't know why I didn't think about this earlier, but regardless, neither here nor there. Uh, this is what a lot of attorneys do. Um, you can either do. No, okay, it's not there. But sixteen. Okay. Go here. Put it there. Got. All right, you're gonna put uh, backslash s, lowercase s, backslash stands for signature. That means digital signature, of course. Uh, you can, uh, there is ways you can sign documents, uh, you know, where it's more scriptive, more, you know, where you can choose what uh, font you want it in, so on and so forth, where it looks like a fucking signature. And you got ones that, where you can actually put a signature from your mouse pad uh, with a stylus. Um, so there you go, you save that, you do the same thing on your other motion and, or, or, on, or on your motion in general. Uh, oh, what the, what the, 
you know what? Just yes, yes, yes. I am. I don't care what it says. Go, 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 go away. All right. Um. So there you go. There you have it. That's your motion. That's what you do. That's what it's looked like. It's a good sample. Uh, I'm gonna have more videos of more uh, different techniques. Uh, things to request, so on and so forth. You know, the videos are not ending. This is going to be a never ending process. All right, brothers and sisters, you have a good day. Have fun. Let's, let's get them. Hey, YouTubers. Uh, this is a edit. Um, I forgot to include this in the video. After you, uh, after you file, or after you made motion, your motion, uh, you will, hold on, you will have to um, figure out what email to send your motion to, because once you have your numbers, and everything and once you're open you don't got to send it to the mail you send it through email I mentioned this in the video before hold on there you go electronic filing oh yeah that's a registering account but the email that emails you back when, hold on, you're going to have to still sign up for that too. You're still going to have to do that, but, um, hold on, where is it at? It should be here somewhere. Um, contact, email updates. Oh, contact us right here. <laughs> Duh. I am an idiot. All right. Once you find out what district your court is, they'll send you an email back. You ask them. Jersey. Do I send my motions to? Call your name, your email, subject. Oh, it doesn't matter. You put anything. You put nothing. Uh, yeah, that's it. That's all. So you put, and then you're done. They contact you back. You copy and paste, and then you drop the. Uh... Oh God. Um. Okay. Real quick. Uh. This is what you'll end up having to do. Compose. Okay, whatever email they give you, you copy and paste it there, attach file, attach it there, you wait for it to load, and then send. See, it's loading. All right, done. You click send motion gets filed it, it updates pretty quickly on uh, pacer you, you, you know they'll probably uh, end up uh, putting it on the ne either next day or that day okay so uh, again if anybody has any questions please don't hesitate to contact me and you already know we're all in this together see you later youtubers